हेलो माय डियर चिल्ड्रन दिस इज मितिका फ्रॉम सेंट जेवियर सीनियर सेकेंडरी स्कूल हरदोई चिल्ड्रन बिफोर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल लाइक इट शेयर इट एंड फॉर गेटिंग लेटेस्ट अपडेट डोंट फॉरगेट टू प्रेस द बेल आइकन सो चिल्ड्रन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न चैप्टर फोर द नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर फोर इज एम एस पेन सो चिल्ड्रेन वॉट इज एम एस पेन द एम एस पेन इज अ सिंपल प्रोग्राम फॉर ड्राॅइंग एंड पेंटिंग ऑन द कंप्यूटर ओके चिल्ड्रेन सो To start MS Paint, follow these steps. Click on Start button, then select All Programs, then click on Accessories, and after that, click on Paint. Step one: click on Start button, select All Programs, click on Accessories, and then click on Paint. The Paint window opens. It looks like this using Windows XP. Okay, children. So these are the part of Paint window. Title bar. below this menu bar and tool box it's a tool box drawing area this plain area is called a drawing area and it's a color box so children menu bar in the menu bar you can see here some options are written there file edit view image colors help okay so when you will click on the file okay to so on menu bar you can see each menu each menu has a list of different options like if you will click on the file option okay the drop down list will come and the options will be there new open save print like this okay if you want to select edit so after clicking on edit the drop down lists will come and the options will be a undo redo cut copy clear selection like this okay and view also image also when you will click on the image some options will become in the drop down list like resize okay rotate like this so you can select from there and it's a toolbox here you can see two tool box in a rectangular shape and an star shape okay Th these are the selection tool rectangular tool it's a select tool and it's a free form select tool we use these to select whole or part of the image the selected part can be cut copied or edited without affecting the rest of the image okay if you are selecting rectangular tool select tool so the selected area will have a rectangular shaped guide box around it and to select an irregularly shaped area you can use this tool free form select tool so it's a select tool and it's a free form select tool now paint window open using windows 7 and it looks like this paint button tabs title bar drawing area okay if you are using paint window in windows 7 okay so you will the paint window look like this it's a drawing area it's a title bar it's a tabs paint button and ribbon let us look at the ribbon more closely and see what all is present on it we can see small pictures representing tool in the tool box and it's a color box so what you observed at the options are same but in the windows 7 but in the windows 7 all the parts are top of the window is it okay to children good now i'll explain to you tools okay which will help to you for making drawing eraser tool color picker tool pencil tool airbrush tool line tool rectangle tool ellipse tool fill with color tool zoom tool brush tool text tool curve tool and polygon tool children with the help of this image images you can guess that what if you want to draw a line okay so which tool you will select obviously you will 
select the line tool okay if you want to do the circle so you will select a ellipse tool yes so here you can see if you want to draw the curve line so which tool you will select obviously you will select the curve tool is it okay children like this if you want to write something in your drawing okay suppose after making the drawing you want to write your name over there huh? so how you will write you need uh, some text so if when you will select the text tool you can write your name over there okay it means it used for writing test in selected area like this airbrush also you can use to spray color on drawings and brush tool it is like a brush used to draw on paper is it okay children rectangle tool if you want to draw the circle square and rectangle then you will use the rectangle tool yes and if you want to draw the circle you will use the ellipse tool is it okay children so these are the tool okay now edit menu edit menu is present on the menu bar the edit menu has the following main options undo repeat cut copy paste clear selection select all children after drawing if you want to edit something in your drawing so how you will do you will do you edit with the help of this menu okay when you will click on the edit menu these options will come you can undo you can repeat cut copy paste clear selection and select all also so what is undo undo command helps you undo the last action performed and repeat action does the opposite of undo it helps to repeat the last action is it clear children now if you want to cut then you will click on the cut option yes if you want to make the duplicate copy of your diagram then you will do the copy and after copy you must paste it when you will paste you will get the duplicate copy of your drawing which you have drawn is it okay if you want to delete all all portion then you will use the clear selection command okay now select all if you want to select your image then you will click on select all when you will click on select all, all your whole image will be selected is it clear children now here you can see the some, some shortcut keys undo control plus z okay so you can use these shortcut keys children you must learn these keys okay these are the shortcut keys of these options so for undo control plus z repeat control plus y cut control plus x copy control plus c paste control plus v okay don't write here control plus p if you will write the control plus p it will be the shortcut key for print your file okay so the paste for pasting your image you will use the shortcut key control plus v yes clear selection you will use the del command and select all control plus a when you will press the control plus a your entire image will be selected yes after making the drawing if you want to save your file okay if you want to save your file then you can press the shortcut key control plus s for printing your file you can press control plus p so these are the shortcut keys you must learn it children okay now using flip and rotate option this option of image menu helps to flip or rotate a complete drawing or a portion of it these steps are when you will click flip or rotate okay this type of dialog box pop up on your screen so select the part of the image click on the image menu and select the flip rotate option okay now click the options you want and see the effects if you want to 
flip your diagram or rotate your diagram horizontally then you will select the flip horizontal and click on the ok if you want to do your diagram vertically flip ok rotate vertically then you will click on flip vertical and then click on the ok button and you can see the flip horizontal and flip vertical is it okay children now resize and skew the stage and skew option of image menu helps to change the size of the drawing proportionally in all directions or only one direction and the image will change accordingly okay when you will click on the resize and skew this type of dialog box pop up on your screen and from here you can do the settings horizontally vertical and skew you can change the degree from here horizontal vertical after changing you will click on the ok button ok children now you will get what you will get your diagram will be resized ok and skewed also so here you can see this diagram resize and it's a skew understood children very good now it's a time to do some exercises so first of all we will solve some multiple choice questions okay are you ready children very good paint is the computer program for playing games making drawing writing letters yes your answer will be a making drawings paint is the computer program for making drawing this tool allows you to write text in the picture if you want to write some text in your picture how you will write using eraser tool no because it's erase your image text tool line tool line tool for drawing a line yes for writing something you will use the text tool very good so the answer will be a text tool to select an irregularly shaped area you can use this tool remember children irregularly shaped i am talking about the irregularly shaped it means you will select the free form select tool okay children so yeah, your answer will be a free form select tool select all option is in menu is in file menu is in view menu or is in edit menu yes your answer will be a edit menu tool selects rectangular area again remember here i am talking about the rectangular area so it means you will select the select tool okay and free form select tool for irregularly shaped okay brush for painting so here your correct answer will be a select tool command deletes the selected part of the drawing clear selection command or select all command or paste command yes your answer will be a clear selection command you have all have given your answer correct very good children now it's time to do the matching identify the tool buttons and match them with their labels by drawing lines okay children already i told to you with the help of this image you can identify your tool okay so rectangle tool now search where is the rectangle yes you will match it with rectangle eraser tool where is the eraser yes it's a eraser pencil where is the pencil it's a pencil very good ellipse tool where is the circle it's a circle ellipse tool line tool where is the line you will you can match it from here very good fill with color tool where is fill with color tool yes it's a fill with color tool text tool means writing something so where is the a yes it's a text tool brush tool where is the brush tool yes it's a brush so it means you will match it with brush very good children you all have done all the matching correct now it's a time to do a home assignment cross solve the crossword puzzle with the help of picture close here you can see some picture and with the help of this picture you will fill this puzzle 
ओके चिल्ड्रेन गुड बाय टेक केयर थैंक यू